Hello everyone, welcome back to potentially either one, the final video, or number two, the final recording session of... Um, Saints Row. Unfortunately, last time we lost our beautiful car, the Hammerhead, so we only are left right now with the fans. So let's an ambulance. I've been anyway, we got one more recording session remaining, potentially, because I think this is the last mission of the game. Oh, look at that milkshake guy from Fall Guys. <laughs> Are you dickhead? Eh, okay. Oh wait, there was no one in that car, wow. I just realized that, you know, after driving past him, I was like, wait a minute, there's no one in that car. Fuck you, nobody. <laughs> but yeah. Oh my god, he just fucking sped off into the night. But yeah, I'm, I'm actually excited to get done with this game so I can go, like, certain games, it's like kind of like you play them just because you want to go into the next one, you know. I haven't really had that, but I will have that. It's, it will be the same as like the first Assassin's Creed game. I also don't know if this is actually a mission or if this is a fucking cutscene to end the game with. If this is a cutscene, then the... Also, you will easily be able to know which one I chose, because... If the last video, the last recording session was two videos, then, I, then this will be one video. Or it's the other way around, because the fact that... Uh, if this is part 50, then you know that uh, this is the only video. Oh, this is the end. Uh, and if this is part 49, then you know that there's going to be another video coming. Because this is your last chance to save the game on the save now. Sure, why not? Let's have some fun. Now, nah, let's go all the way back down here. Because I don't remember there being actually a mission, something that I had to do. I just remember it's being like, I think this is just a cutscene and that's it. Alright. Let's do this. Salting the earth. Fuck the planet. Salt it all you want. Your guest is here, Mr. Yos. Mr. Yos. If you don't mind, could you wait outside? This guy sounds familiar. This is like uh, Clancy Brown. I'm Richard like Hughes. It is a pleasure yeah, it is. to meet the man who handed me the election. Hmm. No need to be modest. I'm serious. There's no way I could have beaten Marshall Winslow. God rest his soul. But you made the impossible happen, and for that, I can't thank you enough. Uh -huh. I mean, had Winslow been the only person killed, attention would have definitely been cast on me. But after that fireworks display you pulled at his funeral, it's become abundantly clear these horrible crimes were perpetrated by the Third Street Saints. Uh, While before you... people criticized my Saints Row urban renewal plan, it is now oh. being lauded. You motherfucker. See, until you came along, I was displacing poor people. Now, I'm destroying a hotbed of gang activity. <laughs> what can I say? The public is fickle. Champagne. And he's also innocent entirely. <laughs> oh, as you get older, you quickly learn that there are only two types of people in this world. Race, money, gender, none of this matters. At the end of the day, you're either a winner or a loser. Now, the sad truth about our situation is King. that in order for me to be a winner, My man. I have to level your neighborhood <gasps> Donnie. and salt the earth. Are you Hold fucker? For a moment. Steven, could you come in here? Where was I? Oh yes, salting the earth. Ha! Huh. Now I suppose Mission I could try to pay you off, but really, what's the point? Julius? You just say no, or in your case, stand there looking intimidating, and we'd be right back to where we started. So I figured <gasps> I'd cut the middle man and get right to the point. Yo, can you speed this shit up? I want to go to freckle bitches. You're going oh, to my man, I talked yourself. again. Make no mistake about that. But if it makes it any easier on you, I'll be sure to thank you in my acceptance speech. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a party to- Oh, what the fuck? I'm dead. I've been betrayed from all angles. Julius was standing there and did nothing. We have the fact that that- Oh, fuck, what was his name? I forgot his name, but he is a an undercover cop, and that's the end of Saints Row, yay! What the fuck, I'm dead! Well, Saints Row 2 is cancelled, that's for sure. I'm dead. No sequel ever. Holy fuck, this took like five minutes, what the fuck, dude? I might be able to attach this to the last recording session. Oh, please don't tell me this is copyrighted. 
Oh, I'm fucked. I'll look it up right now, actually. Is the, uh... The home of the gun clap is more time criminals, sneak thievers and carjackers. Where the streets fight back and shoot out to bound to happen. Ain't nobody scrapping all of these killers. It's taking action, gang wars. Yeah, we bang to the death, gaining respect in the intelligent city. Think smart and wear your best. Watch your right just as well as your left. Cause nine out of ten times we'll creep from behind and blow the tech. Fuck, I think this is copyright. No, that's so fuck up this entire fucking session. Because I can't edit this shit out. Oh, you're a dick. Anyway, that's the end of Saints Row 1. Uh, what a game, what a fantastic I think this is a fantastic game. I think that the second one is better, obviously, but this is a really good game. Like I said, I'm also not much of a reviewer, so that's basically the sense all you get. And they called an 8 out of 10 for this game. I actually really love this game. I hope I can waste time to like 20 minutes. Because like last time, I actually didn't have any more time. I'm also fucking around with my headphones, so it might be the most Hearing Because I put it down yeah. I actually really enjoyed this game I love the writing That's basically what I love about the game It's like the writing So yeah I always like to show off the credits But this is gonna fuck me entirely So yay I'm gonna get fucked I don't know Maybe I can like do a, like a split in the video And then for this entire section Lower the volume and then see what happens. Man. Anyway, that's all I really have to say. I really enjoyed the game. Um, there's actually three sequels to this game with a fourth one upcoming. Saints Row 5 is apparently upcoming, but yeah, so obviously we're not dead. Or maybe the next game has the uh fuck. A new main character, potentially. Ooh, wouldn't that be... No, it's not. This uh, just anyway. into the newsroom. A deadly explosion has rocked the waterfront. Our Jane Valderrama is already at the scene. Jack, that was waterfront fast. residents and the press who were setting up their cameras and microphones to cover the gala fundraiser scheduled for mayoral candidate Hughes campaign were treated to an amazing sight a few moments ago as the yacht registered to the alderman exploded in a shower of brass and mahogany. We were a safe distance away, so no one here was injured, as, as far as we can tell. But we have no word as to who, if anyone, was actually aboard. We don't know how this happened, why this happened, or even who was on the boat, if anyone, as no survivors have been located. I was inside the press tent when it happened, but witnesses outside say that the peaceful, serene evening was suddenly <coughs> punctured by a vicious explosion that no. not only reduced the alderman's yacht to a pile of floating debris, but knocked out windows and swamped smaller boats throughout the marina. Jack. Wow, fuck. Jane, while you were giving that report, we attempted to contact Alderman Hughes' press secretary, and there was no answer. Do we know where the alderman is? No, we do not, Jack. I've asked around, and no one from the press corps noticed any official movement on the boat, as it's early in the evening, and the event was not scheduled to begin for another couple of hours. Do we know if this was an accident or yet another attempt on the life of a public official? Jack, yes. we don't have any definitive answers on that. And with almost no details emerging yet, we still do not know if this was something as silly as a galley or a fuel tank explosion. But in ah, the light of recent events, you silly we cannot kids. rule out the possibility that this was more than just an accident. Reporting live from the waterfront, this is Jane Valderrama. Back to you, Jack. Thank you, Jane, and stay dry. Stay tuned as we get more details on this unfolding event. We will bring them to you immediately. In the newsroom, I'm Jack Armstrong. Kind of, this kind of makes me think that. Uh, this kind of makes me think that this is the uh, like maybe like they did this shit so that potentially there wouldn't be like a sequel in case this game soon. In, in case Saints Row failed, they actually killed off the main character. So it's like we're done. 
that's the only game you're getting but then it was like oh my god it's a success so it's like well all right boys back to the fucking studio we gotta make you know, back to the workplace we gotta make some we gotta make a sequel to this we gotta make an actual sequel to this game this game was a fucking smash and get back into your chairs right now we need to make a second one how do we do that sir use every asset from this game possible right just right a story people don't mind if we reuse assets as long as we got a fan base story and you know the assets in this game actually kind of look good for you know the time so it's like reusing it wouldn't have been such a horrible thing I mean this game definitely does not look like you know uh, your GTA 4 or something like that and I'm happy about it now I hope that none of the songs that are kind of right now that you can listen to are uh, copyrighted because I typed it in and nobody Yeah, I looked it up and it, I don't really get it. I hope it's copyright claim on a Saints Row video posted in 'll anything against it it will get you a strike but the thing is YouTube has like a uh, system in place where right now at least where you can uh, edit it where they can edit, kind of like they can edit the video for you and uh, when you use that the audio will be distorted in a sense you can see it in the, uh, the first video of spider-man on PlayStation 4 and I think also part 9 of city and episodes which I think will be up when this goes up I don't know that for a fact, but I think so. Let me just look at my uploading schedule. When is this video going up anyway? I'm just curious about that one. And even though that now, I have nothing to do. So I just gotta wait. Are we gonna find out the fate of the main player character? Called player. But... Nope, that's it. Done with the game. Great. I wanna know when this goes up, actually. For myself. Obviously, I already said what's coming next. Obviously, next up, we're going to be doing Saints Row 2. Dude, this did not really take 20 minutes, did it? It's 12 minutes long, really? I don't want to have a short fucking video, so I might actually combine this with the next one. Uh, let me go over to videos. I hate that I can't hear shit from this. Maybe it's because I lowered the volume. Nope. Yeah, I gotta extend the video somehow, you know? I would like to have a 20 minute. Like, I, I, I personally want to make my videos 15 to 20 minutes, so... Let me see here. Saints Row is now on the list here. I want 50 videos, so I just gotta count up from the ne next one. Okay, so that's... The six days added to September 8th. September 9th. That's like September 14th, I guess, is when this uh, video is going up. Because uh, this one will probably just be 15 minutes because I want to make it uh, 50 videos. So yeah, it's part 9. That one actually goes up the day that this video goes up, so I guess the reference works that you guys can see it. But anyway, that's the end of Saints Row. Yay, we're done. God damn it, what a ride it's been, hasn't it? We've had ourselves a couple of crashes, you know, but overall, I will say that this game is actually really good, and if you've never played it before, I would highly recommend that you go out and buy, play it. Now, I think this game might only be available on PC and Xbox. Now, I know it's an Xbox exclusive. I think I think it's actually an Xbox exclusive. I don't know that for a fact. Let me look it up. Saints Row. Here we are. Here we are, Saints Row. Video game series. First game is exclusive to the Xbox 360. So, 
Uh, I guess you can't play it outside of Xbox. Anyway, if any of you own an Xbox One or an Xbox 360, I would highly recommend you would play this game. Now, for everyone else on the planet, you would probably just start with Saints Row 2, because I think that one was multi-platform, which I absolutely fucking hate. Why would they do that shit? Why would you do that, huh? Why would you make a game series? The first game is going to be exclusive. And then everything else afterwards is multi-platform. It's like, that's so dumb. What about the people who want to play the first game? They can't. Holy fuck, this is insane. Is this the first trailer for like Saints Row or some shit like that? I always hate that shit. It's like for PS3, Xbox 360 and PC is where the second game came in. But the first game is still exclusive to P... Uh, to Xbox 360 or just Xbox because Xbox One has backwards compatibility. So it's also on Xbox One, which is how I'm playing it. But anyway, that will be the end of Saints Row. Now, I'm sorry about the lack of music or anything like that. The thing is, is that this, this game is highly copyrighted. So I'll just do this shit. I can do a little bit of this. I can do like a little bit of this, okay? I can just do a little bit of this. I can just shake the fucking uh, analog stick. There you go. Now you have sound, right? Anyway, I have really enjoyed it. Like I said, I'll, I would give the game an 8 out of 10. It's got some annoying missions, but that's, you know, a, a standard thing for GTA. Um, but yeah. So, like I said before, next time we will be going into Saints Row 2. So I hope you guys have enjoyed. And if you did, please hit that like button. S please subscribe if you're new, because I still got that whole thing going on. That if by the end of 2020 I get a thousand subscribers... I'll do a QA. and uh, It's just something that I'm saying, but if it actually... Look, right now it's just something that I'm saying. Just some nonsense that comes out of my mouth. But, if I can actually get a thousand subscribers by the end of the month, uh, by the end of the year, uh, by the end of 2020 that is, I'll do it. I will play... I will do a QA. and a So, it's kind of like something that I'm saying right now because I don't really have faith in it. But if it happens, it will happen. So anyway... Like I said before, I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, please hit the like button, subscribe if you're new, and turn on notifications. And, see you guys next time for Saints Row 2. Bye!